Mr. Mm. Sandman. What a pain. But why? Send me a man. Make it the best car door he can. Hello, friends. My name is Sinner Knight, and welcome back to Sherlock Holmes The Awakened Remastered. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, so I had to look up a small bit of a walkthrough because this game is just so... <sighs> so, uh, there's two things that I missed. One, uh, one of them is I gotta talk to the barman about the guy with the silver eye, and the other one is I have to show the medallion to the guy with the turnip alcohol. Uh, I didn't read anything past that, so we're just gonna talk to them about that. Hello to you again, sir. I won't waste time. We have discovered new details that may lead us to this elusive seaman. Most significantly, the man has a missing eye and wears a silver ball in its place. By God, that can be no other than Dirty Summers. A nasty brute, that one. Where could one find him? He must have signed on with a ship, because he was here last night looking to hire some men. How did he behave while he was here? He gave me extra to secure the private table behind that curtain. During his time here, men of all sorts came and went seeking positions. However, he seemed nervous and fearful as his knife was unsheathed and ready the whole of the night. May I examine this table behind the curtain? Certainly, if it will help. Yes. Okay, so I'll go behind the curtain and apparently I can fast travel. I didn't realize I could fast travel. I thought I could only travel to places with the cart. So that's a thing I can do, apparently. These cuts seem quite recent. There are four symbols. Why are there four symbols? Um... Okay. Apparently, I could walk to different places. I'm gonna go back here, and I have to use this on the door. <clears throat> what? One other thing. Have you seen this before? Yes, I saw it. One of the dock workers, an odd sort, gave it to a gang member, Brannock. He wanted Brannock to join their gang, or I don't know what. Must have been nigh on two weeks ago. Two days later, he went missing, and not a word since. This man who gave your friend the pendant, can you describe him? Not very tall, strong, wearing a red cap, and he with a hair lip. You could likely find him near Whereas 12. He told Brannock he worked there. Thank you. By the way, my friend the postman feels badly used. You should change the recipe. I was sure of that. Turnips weren't near rotted enough. Maybe they need a longer soaking in the gutter water. <laughs> now, off with a pair of you. Okay. Sure. Um. The dot 12. Dwarf number 13. Is that this way? Ah, stuck on a feeling. Where the fudge cake is warehouse 12? It's the turnip smuggler. Are you warehouse 12? No. Is it this way? Oh, I can go this way. Dude, I can go this way. Oh god, okay. Let me just run around for a friggin' year. Warehouses. Ah, yes! Warehouse 12! Hall of freaking Luya. Let me in. Hmm, what a pity. The window is closed and the front door is barred. We must gain entry, but how? But why in blazes are we breaking in? Ah, homes! Uh, why in blazes are we breaking in? Is this somewhere I can teleport back to now? It is. Did I get the hook from this guy? I did not. Gave me this. 
Don't mind me. This should prove useful. Yep. I mean, we'll go back to 12. Oh, thank God. Uh, can I use the hook hand? Mr. Mm, Sandman. What a pain. But why? Sammy in a man. They get the best car door hook hand. Yes, there is something here. Yes, there is something here. Yes, there is something here. I'm gonna lose my mind, Holmes. Yes, there is something here. Yes, there is something here. I'm gonna lose my mind. Maybe I need to find a ladder. Let's go further down the alley. That's safe, right? Nothing here? Okay. That's cool. Back this way. Nope. Home's around the barrel. <sighs> I'm recording, right? Okay. Um. This way? Or house seven. Yep, this is useless. All right, well, let's keep going. Wandering around the wharf at night. This way. Not a I'll go this way. Seven. Anything down here? Watson, you're s too good of a friend for Sherlock, you really are. Okay. There's a boat. It's a boat. Really, really, really big boat. Oh. That's where I'm at, huh? Okay. I need something. Mm. I need something. I need something. Do these combine? Oh my god, they combine! <laughs> Let me in. sense but all right ah it bites in a inside but i prefer to let it go after you <sighs> what's this i need something okay this one has blood this should prove useful Indeed it should. 
Well, that's terrifying. The end of this hat pin is covered with blood. Um... Look, Watson, a page torn from an American passport. One Amos Colby, 36 years old, from Boston, Massachusetts. He arrived here just three weeks ago. What business did he have here? This drawing on the back of this page, it resembles some vision of a demon and... Good God, Holmes! It was drawn with blood! Oh, boy. It would seem likely that whoever cut themselves with this pin is also the artist of this demoniac image. Here now, this is hardly reassuring. I need something. Look. That's all? Blood? I need something. All right, all right. Let's look around. Why did I just do that? We can't do this in such a way. How could we lift up this weight? Let us pause to consider the facts, Watson. No mystery can resist an agile mind. Okay. Oh, I see what you want me to do. Look closely, Watson. These marks upon the ground tell the tale. There were repeated trips made between the place with the sailcloth and that large box. So what you're telling me, Sherlock, is that people work here. Alright. Go over here. Turn the valve. <laughs> here push the thing cuz i'm sure it's still that easy what whatever tie the rope Before I do that, though, I've got this iron bar now. Can I open this with the iron bar? Someone has entered these cases of sailcloth to hold something very different, but still suited to their particular form. Oh my god, Holmes, you do not mean that all these crates are better called coffins. Uh, I... What? Excuse me. Sales, and according to this tab, the cases measure two meter by one meter by one meter. Um, the size of a person? All right, let's go. I cannot do this. Bravo, Holmes. They must cut a lot of ropes here. Ah, <sighs> down we go. Let me guess, it's too dark. Good God, Holmes, where are I we? Down Tread lightly, Watson. This place seems alive and watchful. It's just the freaking under the wharf. This isn't like a crypt or something. This is just a place under a wharf. I need something. 
That's terrifying. Okay. Okay. So this might not be. Oh, Lord. Okay. Different symbols? Okay. So. Flabebe. It's a Pokemon, by the way. Um. Missing Link. Uh, tree branch. Uh, monster symbol. Claw. Or part of an anime eye. Uh, then I don't even know what that is. Okay. Bird. I mask uh, raptor. Do any of these look like that? Oh, okay. So this one does. Okay, so the symbol that I don't know what it is looks like the raptor. Oh, do I have to press them in Okay, wait, hold on. Let's undo that. I got an idea. So I need to find one that looks like the bird first. I think that's the tree branch. Because putting this either will look like the tree branch. And then... This one. I, ch I think is Flabebe. Yeah. And then this one will be the monster symbol, I think. So tree branch, flabebe, monster symbol, weird symbol. I think. That's the monster symbol. Let's go look first. Yeah, I think it's the monster symbol. This is the last one. Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> I was not expecting to have a heart attack today. Thought I was playing a mystery game, not a horror game. Though this is very creepy. Oh, this is lovely. What's this? These are beds in a box? Watson, move. Is this more opium? This should prove useful. The fuck did I just get? Coal. Why did you just randomly pick up coal? I swear to God, if I ever end up in one of these situations, I'm just gonna grab everything because I apparently don't know what is and isn't useful. What's this? A box full of pendants in the shape of a pelican. These are brothers to the one found at the Nepali's house. Quite useless. These trinkets are nothing but charming decoys. A box full of... A box I get full it. of pendants. That's over here. It's a lot of fucking beds. Water pitcher? Hmm, that smell. This water contains a strong oh. opiate. Doesn't want coal? I don't want to know what you guys are doing. Hmm, that smell. This water contains a strong opiate. Alright. There we go. Metal.
metal boxes, and here is one that still bears a label. It is in the shape of a flower, which appears to be Edelweiss, and it is black. How remarkable. They are not common. I must take the contents of this box to Baker Street for a more thorough analysis. Opiate, beyond all doubt. You are right. This is definitely an opiate. Holmes, could these villains be opium smugglers? Possibly. Please go back. Alright, I can't see anything else here I can grab. So let's go back over here. Yep, not going there yet. Probably seems a lot less creepy when there are more people here. What a peculiar drawing. Mm -hmm. I found a strange drawing scrawled into the dust on the floor of the secret room located in the warehouse 12. It appears to be a rectangle contained in a cross. And this is also pretty creepy. What's this? Step on it. The left sleeve of this costume bears slight traces of blood, and here the pocket is pierced. Aha! There appear to be papers inside. For you, we shall search the world. Okay. All right. That's wildly terrifying. What a horror! An eldritch horror. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. This man's right index finger is coated with dust. This message is engraved in some language unknown to me. I must make a copy of this message before the police arrive. A herd of buffalo could not leave a greater mess than the local constabulary. Okay. This message is engraved in... I must make a copy of this... Symbols. Bravo, Holmes. Uh, this is just awful. This man was bound with rope shortly before his death. Uh huh. This man has a small wound on his left thumb. He must have drawn that strange figure in blood on the torn passport page. Hmm. Yep, that's the most interesting thing on here. I missed the statue that I thought was the, uh, was a piece of cloth. This man fought hard before his tragic end. The dreadful looking broken statuette reveals much about his terrible struggle. This unfortunate man must have interrupted the kidnappers while they were transferring their victims. What are you speaking about? All of the kidnapped people were kept here and from the look of things for some days. There must have been a good number of them, so they were drugged to keep them docile. Then, with the vile assistance of Riffraff, hired by Dirty Summers, they loaded these people into the missing cases from the warehouse. Last night, these poor unfortunates were loaded onto a waiting ship. Their destination as yet unknown. Oh my god! Holmes! Look! A 
Is he still alive? Oh god, no. What the fucking hell? Ew. Ah, uh, eels. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's leave this place, Watson. We can do nothing uh, ha, ha, here. Ha, ha, ha. Please. Thank you. See that this is delivered to Mr. Holmes at the Diogenes Club as quickly as possible. Do not leave without his reply, though such insistence will undoubtedly cause Mycroft some distress. What the devil are you doing, Holmes? I am sending a letter to my dear brother and including a reference to the strange markings I found on the temple stones. Perhaps he can make something of them. Watson, I must know what was in the metal boxes that we I'm found sorry. in this strange temple. Okay. <laughs> Not happy. It's opium. It's mustard seed. And there, it is done. This is a very fine powder. Perhaps if I apply yeah, heat... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That smell... Undoubtedly a derivative of opium and morphine. This is the same compound on the ball found at Stenick's place. Yeah, his kid is kidnapped. <sighs> How goes it, Holmes? What is the result of your analysis? Without question, this is clearly a derivative of opiate. Something still troubles me, though. The facts indicate this substance must have been used in large quantities. But no English druggist could provide such an amount. Far too risky. And I do not believe British customs would allow such a large quantity to pass through unremarked. Well, I am convinced of quite the opposite, Holmes. How can that be, Watson? Explain your reasoning. Please remember that, as a doctor, I am accustomed to the use of various compounds, including powerful derivatives such as distilled opiates. Those imported from the continent enjoy a special status with British customs, who do not bother the shipments and take little note of the quantities inside. Such shipments are easily identified by their labels. They always bear the identifying mark of the particular medical academy within that country which has an agreement with our own governing academy. Though I can't determine the precise country of origin, I would swear the label scrap left on this crate is one such as this. Doctor, I will never get to the end of your possibilities. You have solved this little riddle for us. Quickly, and waste no time, we must get ourselves to the custom inspector's office at the harbour. What? Now? Can't it wait for our tea? Oh, coming, Holmes. The customs office... Was near here? No, it was near here. Yeah, we'll just go here. Ah, uh, customs, customs. I swear it was near here. Yeah, here we go. This place. There's very obviously something here. Let me look at it. All right, fine. Hey. 
Sir, did you find what you were looking for? Yes, and no. Tell me, where can I find the customs agent? The man's name is Beddoes, and at this time of day, you'll likely find him on the pier near a ship. Thank you. You have been most helpful. Pleasure to be of service, sir. So that's something, at least. But I have to be able to get that letter from the customs house. I have to, right? Watson, move. This game is going to be the death of me. Ah. Now you let me take the letter. O'Reilly, the child came and said that Sandra was giving birth and that she claims to be th and that she claims me to be the father. The boat is clear. You will easily find the registers not far away. Philo? Let us hope that these registers contain what we need. They must so be where? I wonder somewhere. where they could be. Aha, these must be the registers. This one concerns special imports. Hmm. Nothing definite or comprehensible here. All that they mention is that these goods were stored in Warehouse 16. I see nothing further of interest here. Best to leave these ledgers as we found them. Okay. So... Can I go... There's a boat there. There's a boat here. I have no reason to go there. The iron boxes were stored here. A careful search of the place might reveal some valuable evidence. I was just clicking. What? Hold on, Watson. These traces have much to tell us. Regard how they resemble those Their nearby. Footprints? The size is undoubtedly seven. The shoes are also hard soled. The right shoe is missing a nail. Ah, Watson, our case would have. Footsteps found in Mr. Sinwick's garden bear a striking similarity to one set of footsteps found in front of Warehouse 16. They are both a size 7, are fully shot, and have a nail missing from the sole of the right shoe. I see no way of opening this door. Filthy tar! My shoes are thick with it! I see no way of opening this door. I see no way of opening this door. I maybe we'll go around the back. Wait, where does the troll go? Was this here before? If it was, I certainly didn't see it. Uh, now I can go in this area. Yo, what's this? Here is a tab. This one is less damaged. Huh, okay. Excellent. We now know the source of these illicit goods. Watson, we shall now return to Baker Street. There is much to be done. And you couldn't have done this before? Have we received any word from Mycroft? It seems to me there is a letter on the table for you. Perhaps it is from Mycroft. Sherlock, the Northwood Agency is based in Boston, Massachusetts, America. They engage in a wide variety of confidential investigations, but generally they are regarded as specialists in international searches for missing people or works of art. They have a solid reputation built upon an outstanding record of successful results. Amos Colby was employed in Europe as one of their operatives, and he corresponds to the description you gave. Unfortunately, the details of his last case were confidential, as for now. 
I have included an approximate translation of the characters that you discovered, though it is a rough and I must admit, rather enigmatic. Sincerely yours, Minecraft. My 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 Minecraft. Cool. Uh So, the poor devil who lay under this warehouse was indeed the owner of the passport embellished with the drawing made in blood. His thumb was gashed. His thumb. He was most assuredly the one who made the drawing during his captivity. But what brought him to this place? Furthermore, if this detective agency has any standing, it rests on the reputation of its associates. They are rightly regarded as proven professionals. <laughs> Therefore, this dying man's last efforts were to leave clues for those who might come after him. Remember, Watson, this man's forefinger was also coated with dust, and we found drawing drawn in that very same dust upon the floor. Exactly, Holmes. An addition symbol was there, placed within a rectangle. Let us consider the facts, Watson. A number of people were taken by force underneath Warehouse 12, drugged, and then transferred in boxes by ship to some as of yet unknown destination. For the moment, London has nothing more to tell us. These people, whoever they are, have a small advantage. We should give them no more. We must make our departure, but to what destination? Wait, Watson! I have a sudden thought. What do an Edelweiss and a rectangle containing an addition symbol signify to you? Germany? Your intentions are good, my dear Watson, but you have missed everything of importance. I already said Germany. Wait, 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 wait. the fuck is that company the I mean it's the Swiss company but it's the one like a Swiss army knife Switzerland Switzerland, of course. Watson, we shall divide our tasks. I shall report the particulars of Mr. Colby's death as this affair requires the utmost intact and discretion. Well I never thank you I am sure Watson, you know I'm impersonal. Each man to his specialty. I rely on you to book passage for two to the continent immediately. And, Watson, see what you can learn Edelweiss. of an institute it's called the Swiss Black Edelweiss Swiss? and determine if it is located in Switzerland. If this place can be found, I believe it holds the answers that we seek. Now, hurry, man. The game is on. The game is on. Uh, why do you have the statue just sitting in the compartment with you? The game crashed. The game crashed. It crashed. So, uh, yeah, this has been fun. Uh, yeah, bye.